Um, definitely the change in my work atmosphere. I mean, it's not my career or anything, but not having so much drama at work has been a miracle. I, I mean, I actually enjoy going to work now, and that's awesome. And it was all just because I, uh, the personality types, learning that and learning mine, and I'm able to like conflict resolve really easily, like. I can see people start getting riled up and I, I know because of how they are and their personality types, I can just I can just smooth it out. Or I can just tell them they're being stupid, but in a nice way. <laughs> and um, and then with customers too, like I have customers and they'll only shop with me at Dillard's now and they just love me now. And so I'm hoping as I grow in this to take this into my skincare business and and really build those connections with my own clients because they're going to be long-term clients and when I have a team as well. Um, learning emotional intelligence uh, because now I can kind of figure out why things bother me when they do and how to deal with it in a way that's not annoying <laughs> to everyone else. <laughs> and. Um, and I can just like kind of pinpoint, oh, I am upset right now because they said this to me in this certain way and I'm just seeing things wrong. And I can just really just deal with it. And it's really awesome. Uh, it's caused, like created so much peace in my house, with my family, with friends. I don't really take it so personal with other people and I can see things differently now. Um, and with clients, because in my business, there's a lot of rejection, and because of my personality type, rejection's a big deal. I hate it, <laughs> but now it's not personal. It's not a personal rejection, it's just, you don't want this right now, that's fine. Sucks for you, because it's awesome. <laughs> and let's see, what else? Uh, learning body language, because of I have the D personality type, which is like, you can come off as a jerk <laughs> and so I would have that they call it RBF but I'm not gonna like tell you exactly what that means but pretty much your face always looks angry and um, now it doesn't <laughs> so it's really good because I can just I can feel it I can I'm really aware of it now I'm like oh I have RBF I need to stop <laughs> and so and then, uh, you know, not crossing your arms and looking awkward and, like, I can just really uh, open up but um, not be like the wacky waily flailing inflatable tube man. And that's good too because when I get really excited that happens and I'm just all over the place and that's not good either. <laughs> and, um, and then again, personality types, as I already had said, personality types is a really big deal and really, really helps with um, with people, and I love them, I love people, and so kind of being able to pinpoint, maybe they're not exactly that personality type, but I can kind of see it and know how to interact with them to have a better relationship and better rapport. And that's, I mean, it's just changed night and day. At work especially, I can see it because that's where I practice it the most, is I, I get along with everyone. <laughs> and it's really weird. <laughs> so it's, it's such a refreshing change. I wish I had this in like junior high and through high school. It would be really helpful. <laughs> I think the most surprising result for me was learning about myself. And um, I had no idea. I, I, I'd be like, why do I feel this way about those things or why do I react like this or why is it sometimes I'm like so not motivated and sometimes I've got to get everything accomplished in one day and I realized it was just my personality types and um, and kind of a how you process things when things happen so I think one of the most powerful things you can do as a person and for a business or with your family or anything is know yourself and if you don't know yourself 
you're a hot mess for everybody else and you're totally unaware of how you're um, coming off to people and how you're affecting your your atmosphere. It, it's such, I mean, it, it really opens up the door because, and then you can see you're actually pretty cool. When you uh, process this and, and you deal with it a different way, you're not so bad. You're, you know, you're, you're made perfectly individually exactly the way you need to be. And so when you get to know who you actually are, you can bring all of those good things out for everyone else around you. And it's just, it's really powerful. It really changes things. Everything. <laughs> I took it twice for a reason. I really like loved it so much. I wanted to actually do it again, but I was like, that's a lot of time. I'll just go online and do it. But, um, <clears throat> For me, emotional intelligence was the big one. I need, I need more of that, honestly. I really need a lot more. And so having the emotional intelligence and learning triggers and how to calm yourself down, because I could get I could, I could get angry, like I'd be fine, and then someone would say one thing and look at me wrong and be like, mm. and I would get like this inner ghetto woman come out, and it's really not good. So uh, the emotional intelligence really, uh, helps you kind of pinpoint, again, like, why are you acting like this? Stop it. <laughs> and um, and then uh, also kind of, it, it would either, like, I would be, like, angry really easily or whatever, I'd get in, a, in a, an emotional state really easily, or I would suppress everything. And then it, I'd be like, why am, I, why am I getting physically sick? I'm fine, there's nothing wrong. Everything's fine. Everything's beautiful. And actually, I was just pushing things down and down and down until I had like a mental breakdown. <laughs> it would just happen over and over. And I'm like, well, this is not good. And uh, I had no idea why. And then having that emotional intelligence class, I'm like, oh, that makes so much sense. And uh, it's, it's really, oh, man, it's just, it's so helpful. You need to take that. If you want to change your atmosphere, if you want to change your relationships, if you want to have better connections with other people and um, have um, more success with business and just anything that you do, you need to take this class. It's not, it's not like that high school or it's not like your community college um, Calm 101 class. It's totally, completely different. It's, um, it's, it's useful for everyday life. Like, it's not just something that, oh, let me brush up on this when I go to do a business presentation. It's what you can do with like every single day. And since I've done it, I have deeper relationships with people and I have um, peace at home and at work and I am building customers and I'm, it's just, it changes everything because it rewires the way you think about other people. And I've noticed too, one thing that really caught me was um, we learned about how we see ourselves in everybody else and we automatically think that everyone else thinks the way that we think and we project ourselves onto others. And that is just such a hot mess thing to do. You can't, you can't do that. And so having that training to see the person for who they are and because you know who you are and then you can see who they are it completely just takes all of this pressure off from performing with other people or uh, faking it through a relationship or um, you know or getting upset over something that they didn't actually say you just heard it that way so it really it really helps it, it's something that I, I like any everyone should take I think it should be offered in like high school and junior high school and um, and especially like if you're gonna get married <laughs> I want to do a marriage version of this if I ever get married that would be good because um, <laughs> it's really important <laughs>